Television, impacting generations. Zako. Kwa hakika umekuwa Mungu mwaminifu, umekuwa Mungu mwema, umekuwa rafiki wa karibu. Lord, we are grateful, we are thankful, oh God. We honor you because of this moment, oh Jehovah Lord. We, we can't just take it for granted, our Father, but we are giving you all the glory, the honor, and the adoration, oh God. We thank you because of our viewers, our Father. We thank you because of Mamraka Breakfast, oh God. Usipoenda nasi hatuwezi mfalme wa amani. Tunaomba uweze kwenenda nasi ili tukawe baraka kwa watazamaji wetu na tukanene kulingana na makusudi yako. Ukifanya hivyo sifa zote ni zako ewe mfalme wa amani. Na ni katika jina la Yesu Kristo naomba na kuamini. Amen, 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 amen. Good morning our viewers pale nyumbani. Karibu sana Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Yeah, Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amoringa <laughs> njobo karibuni katika mamlaka breakfast. We apologize mm. for being late. Yes. Mm -hmm. Due to technical issues, atungeweza kuanza mapema but we thank God that we have started well. Yeah, we, and also we can take it for granted kwa mvua bado. Mhm. Mm Na unaona kwenu kulenyesha hadi ujakumbuka kusema unaitwa nani? Oh. <laughs> you see? <laughs> My name is Grace Njeri and I am your host. And I were ringing and Jomo, and we thank God because of Lane here in Nakuru County. Mm. Sijuka kwenu kumenyesha. Mm -hmm. Na we can take it for granted. Karibu sana katika kipindi chetu cha siku ya leo Mamraka Breakfast on Mamraka TV, Facebook tuko live. Grace Njeri were ringing and Jomo pia tuko live. Our SMS SMS numbers are open for you to continue the conversation with us and tell us where you are watching us from. We would like to thank our viewers pale nyumbani for being with us from Monday, Tuesday and today is Wednesday. Yes. So far so good. The Lord has been faithful to us. The Lord has been faithful to all of you. Hmm? Orenga. Mm -hmm. Aha. Uh -huh. Tumeanza Monday. Na tuko mm -hmm. Wednesday. Na Wednesday imefika tumekuja na baraka za mvua. <laughs> <laughs> baraka tunazo tele tele. Yes, and being a Wednesday Lord tutakuwa tuna tunaongelea kuhusu kingdom investment. I don't mm -hmm. know ikitajwa kwako how mm -hmm. it means to you. Mm -hmm. But before that, we have the the nini? The verse of the day. Mm -hmm. And we have the question of the day. Mm -hmm. Na kama kawaida our grace will take us to the verse of the day. Uh, you know natakanga kukuwa na nini na nini jia in case orenga hmm? it's good morning lakini yeah it's mvua. a good morning it's a good good morning the mvua shouldn't allow you to nini i'm not overdoing anything mm. okay <laughs> our verse of the day comes from the book of hebrews chapter 6 verse 10 it says god will reward uh sorry Orenga, mm -hmm. kuna venye bebo yangu haina iyo. Mm haina -hmm. gani? Haina Hebrews. Haina Hebrews? Mm, haina Hebrews. <laughs> Itako saaje? <laughs> Ayo, for God is not unrighteous to forget your work and labor of love, which you shared toward his name, in that he have ministered to the saint and to ministers. And mm -hmm. we desire that every one of you to show the same diligence and the full assurance of mm -hmm. hope unto the end. Mm -hmm. Mungu si mwana wadamu, mm -hmm. asahau, whatever you do. Mm -hmm. It's not a man to forget whatever you do. Mm -hmm. I said preach. You know the Holy Spirit is about to, to come down right now. So <laughs> anyway, this is today being a kingdom investment Wednesday. Mm -hmm. God is not a man to forget whatever you do. Either in the kingdom, out there. Kama unafanya mazuri, he's not a man to forget. Mm -hmm. Kama unafanya mabaya, bado. He but doesn't do. forget. He's not a man to forget. Mm -hmm. So whatever you are doing, keep it in mind. Your reward is coming. Eta kuja ikiwa mejazwa vizuri. Ime. Shaken together. Mm -hmm. Ime. <laughs> You can help us Malaysia that. Mm -hmm. Your deeds, mm -hmm. chenye unafanya. And I believe we'll have a good time to talk about kingdom investment. Mm -hmm. And not necessarily only in the kingdom. Adi uko inje whatever you are doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And also today, being a Wednesday, we always have the question of the day. Yes. Now, by the way, mm -hmm. uh, this is going direct, direct to our directors. Uh, Monday, mm -hmm. tukona off, tukona holiday. By the way, we are not coming. Directed for the letter, we are on Monday. It's a holiday. 
Na we would like to know ni nani amepeana holiday? Ju eh. holiday ilipeanwa jana. Yeah, tulipewa holiday jana and mm-hmm. that is our question for today. Mm-hmm. Who gave us the public holiday? Jana. Nani nani okay, anapitishwa. By the way, sikosa kwenda kazi eti Warenga and Grace said like hakuna hakuna job at in holiday. What? Lakini like, director anajua tumemwambia tu yeah, in advance. Tumemwambia. <laughs> nani alipeana holiday? Others labda hata yeye mwenyewe atuambie but that is our question of today mm-hmm. who gave us the public holiday mm-hmm. eh mm-hmm. nani ametufanya monday tusinge kazi unajua monday za kosa kuingia kosa kuingia <laughs> <laughs> you can write to us down there using the numbers on your screens 0700 899899 or 0721899899 or also you can comment on our facebook page grace njeri Warenga Wajomo and Mamlaka TV. Mhm. Na kama kawaida when we take a break to Kirudi tunarudi na You know, mm-hmm. today is, it's really expectant. Unajua nimeona leo news leo lakini nikasema lazima tupatie watu wetu the updates and only on Mamlaka TV we give you updates on politics, news, sports fitness and also business wise uh, sure let's take a break to narudi na gazeti ya siku ya leo yes an amazing 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 song there by minister Willy Gitata and pastor Judy Asante sana kwa wimbo mzuri nataka nikujue zaidi na zaidi sure it's our desire also mm-hmm. to know god zaidi na zaidi mm-hmm. but before that ama after that mm-hmm. we have the gazettes for today mm-hmm. lakini before gazeti si kwanza tufika kwa soko hata before hata twende uko sana mm-hmm. mimi ninarudi na shule yetu unajua tulisema jana tunaenda shule lakini tuliana tumerudi na bado leo tunaenda shule mimi nakuja hapa na nakuru college mm-hmm. <laughs> Nakuru College of Commerce and Hospitality. Uh-huh. It's located in Nakuru City, mm-hmm. Equator House, mm-hmm. fourth floor mm-hmm. next to Ereto Bookshop. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. 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 I love Upia. Mm-hmm. Eh, Ishule. Yeah, they have the School of Hospitality mm-hmm. with them. Uh, school of tourism mm-hmm. tourism uh, too tourism. Uh, tourism tourism yeah mm-hmm. uh-huh. school of business studies mm-hmm. school of ICT mm-hmm. school of accounts mm-hmm. school of customerology go, 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 go. Ni cosmetology. Cosme. Cosme. Cosmetology. Mm-hmm. The e is a the cosmetology. Lazima to, to hakikisha ile lipstick yako inafanya kazi. <laughs> As you look I look good thanks to uh, the school uh, Nakuru College Asante ni sana. <laughs> Yeah, a school of fashion and design mm-hmm. eh? mm-hmm. a school of electric, electric, electrical engineering unaona watu wengine sasa hizi tukiongelea electrical engineering we don't blame him mm-hmm. uh, this school is located in nakuru city mm-hmm. for those who are asking us mm-hmm. uh, the number you can contact them is 0727 42 and 42 okay sorry I'll repeat 0727424698 or 0721582532 and just a reminder Nakuru College is governed by the the NITA the exams eh mm-hmm. sijui kama unaenanga unapata ndio kuna college lakini i governed in a castle by governed in any institution yenye inasimamia exams in our country mm-hmm. so it's well to, ni vizuri ujue Nakuru College it's governed by NITA mm-hmm. na castle mm-hmm. na huko Nakuru College tunasemanga defining culture of mm-hmm. professional excellence eh? wako na excellence yani top one of define culture yes <laughs> outside of nakuru college we also have books eh yeah, tuko na vitabu hapa mm-hmm. na acha kuniangalia na huruma sikupati ah ah leo ni wewe it's your time madam to shine eh uh-huh. i have the dose of favor here with mm-hmm. me this book is written by reverend ben <laughs> by reverend ben i uh, inasema unveiling the secret of spiritual doors in your life Unajua for you to succeed there is a secret. Mm-hmm. There must be a secret. Unajua kila mtu na eh na siri yako ni gani? Grace abutu abia siri yako ni gani? Siri yangu ni maombi <laughs> and kingdom investments. 
<laughs> so <laughs> unveiling the secrets of spiritual doors in your life iko hapa ya reverend ben na yeye kashia hapa unajua amesomea account atatokea thanks to nakuru college nimekuwa an accountant doors of favor goes only for 200 kenyan shillings mhm 200 peke yake ukikuja hapa nakuru city chosen generation church nakuru we are going to sort you out you can skip chipo eh chipo chipo usikule chipo sana bakisha pesa ya kitabu bado no ni for 200 shillings i oil of a family deliverer yeah yani kuna vitu tu unaonanga kwa familia yenu you feel this is not what my family should be going through you need to get this book you need to have this book unajua si kila mtu huu notice familia yao iko na shida mm-hmm. kuna mwenye ah unajaribu kumwambia angalia brother yako angalia sister yako if you feel you have the burden of your family mm-hmm. get this book mhm and ujue how you will deliver your family yes na hii kitabu unajua nimesikia kuna barnabas <laughs> <laughs> uh, this book goes for only 500 Kenyan shillings. Oil of a Family Deliverer written by Reverend Benson Nganga. Mm-hmm. Usimalize pesa ya pizza yote. Mm-hmm. Tafadhali get a book. Get a book. Yeah. Get educated. Mm-hmm. Get kuna, some knowledge. Kuna mtu aliniuliza ati kama kuna lipa mdogo mdogo. Anyway, battles from birth. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Vita kutoka utotoni. Eh, ukizali una watu wanakuambia, "Wewe ni kwa pia mashida zenye ulipitia wewe." Adi hatuko tunaona ni kama uta survive. <laughs> okay, ujai ambiwa hivyo na mtu ni like. <laughs> eh, there is no hope for you. Eh, we had no hope. In fact, tulikuwa tumeambia God <laughs> it's <laughs> achukue nafasi ya. <laughs> Acha atawale. Yeah, mm-hmm. you need to get this book. Yes. I know how you'll fight your battles, you know. Vita kutoka utotoni. And there is that ca special line our reverend likes to say. Mm-hmm. Tangu ulipozaliwa. Mhm. Maisha yako imeenda kaya juu imeanguka. Inaenda, mm-hmm. inapanda, inateremka. This book is for you. Mm-hmm. Battles from Bad by Reverend Benson Nganga. Mm-hmm. You can get this book at only 500 Kenyan mm-hmm. shillings. Mm-hmm. In Nakuru City, our churches is open. Mm-hmm. That is Chosen Generation Church Nakuru Sanctuary mm-hmm. Town mm-hmm. and also Barnabas Sanctuary. You oh. can get these books. Denied celebration. Mhm. Hii kitabu tumeyogererea sana. We have talked about this book sana. Mm-hmm. Na jana we felt kuna mtu we needed to give this book after being dinner. Unaona how much celebrity? Yes. Yes. Sita <laughs> mtaja lakini anajua tu. Mm-hmm. So if you feel you should you should be living a good life, you mm-hmm. should be somewhere and my feeling yeah, this is not my life. Unajua kuna venye unajitanga kamkutana and you feel this the, this kind of life I'm living. Tangu lipozaleo you have never been celebrated there is no birthdays for you. Mm-hmm. Yaani miaka yaani But maisha hadi no birthdays. Eh, hey, you know how bad that is significant to say. Mimi let me tell you nikifika 40 years I still want to be done about the director. Nikifika 40 years because I'm almost there. Tafadhali. I want a birthday. Hapo kwa birthday leo nataka kuleta tu emotional torture. Najua hujai celebrate au hujai fanya birthday. Mimi na, na ni safari kop na banko na nikumbushanga happy birthday na bundles za 100 MBs per day. Siku hizi uh, kwanza this year they didn't give me. Ah uh, sorry. Uh, the night celebration by Reverend Benson Nganga also goes for 500 <laughs> Kenyan shillings. You can get it at our city sanctuary and at our Barnabas sanctuary or also you can order the books through our number that is on your screen 0700 899899 or 0721899899 and we will deliver the books wherever you are. Mm-hmm. And today like you are Wednesday March 15. Mm-hmm. Na, niko na gazeti ya Daily Nation. Yes, tunaenda katika magazeti. Uh, allow me to kuguza. Mm-hmm. Unga prices to go up again over maize shortage. Wow. Unga so, inapanda tena. Hatujui kama itafika 250. Mhm. Ama 300. Hatujui. Aya <laughs> consumers will pay more for maize fra after mm-hmm. mirrors in part of country suspended operation owing to an acute shortage of the grain. Mm-hmm. So tutapata hiyo story ni venye imekuwa tu kachi and I felt before I start with why president revived stall dump project. Mhm. Hii ya unga. 
Najua. It's really it's really critical. Uh, sure. Yako, <laughs> On to the standard newspaper with me. I'll read the headlines that states did Uhuru team pay 6 billion for air in telecom deal. Mm -hmm. In spite of money ha money having been paid under the emergency cover office uh on this we can also have there's a there's like a story here down mm -hmm. in page six in spite of money having been paid under the emergency cover office of the attorney general says it has not received the shares and does not even know who the money was supposed to be okay people's people's get security escort as they break for half term by then mekutana na wow what's that you have time umeona wanafunzi how they'll Huh? Adu na jaribu to catch your breakfast normally kama umeingia super to get your breakfast na line imefika I thought these guys opened up the other day yeah wako half term wow. if you didn't know <laughs> <laughs> so kuna mm -hmm. nini uh, side ya Kapidasum primary school in Arabal Baringo mm -hmm. county mm -hmm. wanafunzi wanapelekwa nyumbani na askari si ati ni jua me perform vizuri uh -huh. no because of the insecurities that yes. they are going your side mm -hmm. na ndoni mm, toke front page KMTC expel trainees medics over papers kuna watu KCC walienda wakafuji ndo waingie wa kukuwa medics for medics mm -hmm. aina haja uforge vitu aina haja mm -hmm. whatever you have appreciate yourself live a normal life sure yes on to the standard page two mm -hmm. there's this headline i read on monday about junior secondary schools mm -hmm. so today we have it again on page two of the standard mm -hmm. provide enough books and teachers to mm -hmm. junior secondary schools mm -hmm. the government should move with speed and ensure the pioneer junior secondary learners are equipped with enough textbooks mm -hmm. same way it should also ensure the de deployment of enough teachers who will help the learners navigate the new system shortage of teachers is a major problem it has been established that most of these junior secondary schools hardly have three teachers deployed by the tsc mm -hmm. either working as interns or as permanent basis mm -hmm. so this thing uh I think the education system may have a lot of challenges here and there. Mm -hmm. Junior secondary, mara uju kama uko junior, either uko uko seven ama uko uko up a secondary, you know. Mm -hmm. So teachers have also have an had an issue cuz you know you need to be a learned teacher. Uh, sure. Okay, not being learned, you need to be educated mm -hmm. so that you can teach this junior secondaries mm -hmm. cuz the syllabus will change. Mhm. Mm I heard they're doing even physics. Physics. Yeah. Wow. Ever had, not sure. Sina mtoto kwa hiyo darasa. But we have the quote of the day from Miguna. Miguna. Dr. Miguns. Miguns. If someone tortures and murders innocent Kenyans, he must not be forgiven. Yes. When someone roots public resources meant for job creation, education, healthcare, infrastructure, he must never be forgiven. We wa we must never reconcile with the enemies of the people. Mhm. Mm Asi umeona wewe umeanza na pesa kupotea. No, umesamehe watu. We now mm -hmm. uh, onto that news bad way here. Mm -hmm. I feel like the government needs to whatever is happening right now in our country, the state of our country, everybody knows out there. Mm -hmm. We need to have people who will speak out. We need justice in Kenya. Mm -hmm. The leaders that we elected need to do something. Sure. It's not that uh, a rich person gets justice. Mm -hmm. No, they should be fair and justice to our people. These guys elected you. These guys expect that there is justice given to them. Mhm. Mm na kama kuna shida tunakoanga nayo kama nchi ya Kenya it's mm -hmm. to get justice. Mm -hmm. As a person, unapata kama you don't have a voice. Mm -hmm. The courts, the verandas of court will be your friend. Kelsey na ka from your four fathers. Kwanza in Kiambu and uh, where are the Kikuyu Zalmeni. Mm -hmm. Najua kesi za mashamba. Yes. Ili acho baba ya baba baba ba, the babus mm -hmm. the babus they are the grand mm -hmm. the grand 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 mm -hmm. the great mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i think as judiciary mm -hmm. they should have a way to solve these issues for once sure. and for all unapata mtu alianza ka kesi akiwa msiana amezeeka juzi ya happen kwenda koti hapa kwetu na kuru i had some issues there nikapata mshoshwe na i felt acha ni mwamki ni mwamkie i mean kama mwamkie nikamuuliza uko poa shosh 
Akaniambia mm-hmm. niko poa lakini acha nikwambie iko tu unaona there is a new building there mm-hmm. even before yanze kujengwa i was coming here na muliza kwa nini shosh ni shamba <laughs> even before yanze kujengwa even before yanze kujengwa i just felt her pain Wow. It just felt happen. So mm-hmm. in Kenya kwanza saidia judicially we need to do something. Mm. Acha to solve these cases for once and for all. True. To yani we give them justice. See you know I'm not a I'm not a, what should you but we believe with the, the the people that we have elected the leaders that they will do something. But judicially mm-hmm. imekuwa na okay we can't complain who kilinganisha a few years ago mm, so at least we, we are seeing something yes. and we are grateful sasa hizi unaweza nakuru ko hii hii court ya nakuru mm-hmm. kesi yako ya muliwe the same day so mm-hmm. something is happening yes. in thank god in, in my page uh, my page 3 mm-hmm. varsity recruitment agency in deal to send 150 graduates to germany this is mount kenya university uh wana tuma 150 student uh, germany uh, germany eh wanyo wamefanya hospitality courses so they have a deal mm-hmm. yeah So hiyo ni job creation a creation of jobs opportunities sasa sisi wote tukienda huko tunachia na ni Kenya lakini bado sisi ni Kenya mzalendo mm-hmm. on to the standard of page 6 remember i read for you in the headline of the standard mm-hmm. did you huru team up mm-hmm. to pay 6 billion for air and telecom deal mm-hmm. so this page this mm-hmm. this is a story can find it in page 6 mm-hmm. of the standard newspaper mm-hmm. the controversy over the rushed payments for the government accusation mm-hmm. for telecom Kenya has deepened after it emerged that Jamhuri Holdings is still the majority shareholder even after it was paid 6 billion last year. Mm-hmm. Solicitor General Ken Ogetos yesterday told a joint parliamentary committee that the shareholding of the Telecom Kenya was still in the hands of two companies registered in the Cayman Island and Mauritius seven months after the government purchased the shares. So alilipa hewa You can get this story in page 6 of the standard newspaper. You can you can you can go and read more about it. It's a long story. Shareholders Whether they thought they were to you lipo kwa mashamba. Hadi kwa Telkom na tunabahingi credit touchable. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, jana uh, jana uh, Azimio reader ira Odinga alikuwa siaya. Mm-hmm. Tam jana. Siaya. Aha. Na hapo ndo holiday ilitokea. Ah 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 sasa I'm giving. Mimi unapatia unapatia ni wetu ni ni. So yeah yeah mm-hmm. according to him this is what he had to say. What the mischief they were curing in changing the electoral call as early as two months after they had come to power. So he was complaining electoral mm-hmm. call was rebadirishwa after the president that we are having the current president Ah yeah what happened Ju alingia with two months na ishabadilishwa board commission on electoral konini so as Raira he feels it was not fair Mhm Na unajua kumekuwa na maadamano hapa na pare Mhm But sijui mbona I just love this man not <laughs> politically wise he never gives up He's one of the people that Yesu anamtia nguvu. He never gives up. Yani <laughs> He never gives up. And that's that's the faith that we need. Ananga tu anatulia akirudi, ana come with more force na na hakikisha like he gets what he wants. Yes, on to the standard newspaper page 8. Stage to revive 63 billion Kimware Aro dams in deal with Italians. Mm-hmm. Na kumbuka time president alikuwa anauza manifesto zake the Kimware yako ni mambo ni billion uh 63 billion okay <laughs> the con- the construction of the 63 billion arol and kimwarel dams is set to resume four years after they were halted mm-hmm. this is after president william ruto held talks with his with his italian counterpart sergio Matar- matarella in nairobi in 2019 former president uhuru kenyatta's administration stopped the construction of the twin 
twin dams in Elgeo Maraquet on claims of graft. We have agreed on a framework to settle all court cases. End of quote, said President Ruto yesterday. Mm-hmm. Aya, ni kona taifa leo, inasema hivi. Safari ya chama kimoja ya anza. Safari ya rais William Ruto kuunganisha vya matanzu. Mm -hmm. Vya tawala wa Kenya kuanza kuwa chama kimoja kikubwa imeanza. Bada vya masita kukubari kumezo na chama chake cha United Democratic mm -hmm. Alliance. So, eh, tunarudi one, one, one chama, one voice. One chama. One chama say. kimoja. Yes. Ha? Huh? <laughs> Wewe. <laughs> the standard to Mayona, the nation, we have seen it. Aya, to Rudy, deported Rubis Kenya CEO returns after root of victory. Unakumbuka nani, director wa Rubis, that you come and deport you. Aya, si Muguna Pekeka li defanyo deportation in Kenya. You know, okay. I, yeah, I just love my country. <laughs> Alikuwa me deportiwa mm -hmm. when Uhuru was president. So mm -hmm. after Ruto ali ali chukua waibu wakasema ai na yakaanza kutafuta ya ticket. Kaanza kutafuta nini ya kurudi nyumbani so, home sweet home. Walirudi na migush. <laughs> <laughs> On to the standard newspaper page 10. Mm -hmm. Fuel importation deal will steam dollar shortage not pump prices. Sijui kwa umesikia fununu kwa prices ya mafuta itapanda juu. Mm. So, mm -hmm. onto this story in Asema, the government expects the fuel importation deal it has entered into the three international oil farms mm -hmm. to ease the dollar shortage that has been crippling the economy for the last one year. Mm -hmm. The shortage has worsened in recent months. The government to government agreement is, however, unlikely to bring down fuel prices. This is despite expectations that dealing directly with the oil producing countries would give Kenya an opportunity to get the fuel at discounted rates. Acha to subiri, but hoping mm -hmm. it won't affect, okay, it will affect, but not that much. Mm -hmm. Unona unga inapanda, mafuta inapanda. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I have the star with me. Mm -hmm. Ruto, a world raid rider base is ODM release for dem demos, eh? Mhm. Mm Aya Raila akijitayarisha Ruto na yeye wanajipaga na Owaru. Mhm. Mm Sijui this man is always one step ahead. This man called Ruto. <laughs> you really need to be that. You really need to be one step ahead, <laughs> my dear, eh? Uh, on to the standard page 14. Mm -hmm. State seeks to end 7.9 million case against ex Nakuru official. Mm -hmm. Tumekuja county yetu ya Nakuru. Uh, you, I need you to give us in detail. The state has requested a Nakuru court to withdraw a 7.9 million illegal tender case against former trade chief officer Edith Wanjiro. Mm -hmm. Wanjiro was charged alongside five former and current county officials. They have denied all charges. Mm -hmm. Yesterday, prosecutor Anastasia Mumbe told Chief Magistrate Bildad Ochieng that she was instructed to withdraw the case against Wanjiro. She was granted two weeks to amend the charge sheet. But lawyers for the accused Daniel Kisila, Robert Ndubi, and Owino Owenga raised concern that the prosecution had not supplied them with relevant documents to enable their clients defend themselves. Mm -hmm. These people, they were accused in February 1st, 2023. Nando hiyo ni nisha enda kwa court. Sinaona I'm telling you they are they are working. They are doing they are doing us a lot a lot of work. Mhm. Mm All to still on that page Solio Ranch ordered to surrender 200 acre land. Story is a shamba. Mbona? A wildlife conservancy has been ordered to surrender 200 acres of its expensive land in Laikipia County to a businessman. Mhm. Mm Justice James Olola ordered Solio Ranch Limited to transfer the land to James Moshangi Gashemi within 60 days after completing a sales agreement they entered in 2012. Apa pia naona I have mm -hmm. the same same case lakini mm -hmm. in church in mm -hmm. a person but before that mm -hmm. the governors were me evictua due to land default. That 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 story looks so much juicy. Hey, tell us <laughs> <laughs> so the councils of governors uh, wanakalia deposit. Mm. 
ya from okay he au detail fanyo 2021 june mm -hmm. in 47 counties mm -hmm. and the rent balance mm. in under for 52.86 million wow <laughs> so the governors saizi mm -hmm. wanakalia deposit i don't know about our governor suke heka mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but it's so interesting the president of the press mm. and career deposit <laughs> i thought you only a cc wananchi anyway but before that mm -hmm. church to refund cash for bagod house sale so kulikuwa na sale ilifanywa between catholic church diocese of kisumu mm -hmm. they are supposed to refund 3.8 million 3.8 million. million they obtain from a house buyer over 10 years so an additional interest mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. mr wasike had paid them mm. to purchase the house lakini sasa kama kawaida ina wa inchi sisi kama wa Kenya wa Zalendo mm -hmm. mm -hmm. <laughs> we have to get all, all yani we have always to get some issues up mm -hmm. and pale so justice Rosirin Aburir directed that the amount be returned to Charles Wasike together with uh, the interest wow nami moja kwa moja nitakupeleka sekta ya biashara tunaenda pale page 24 of the standard newspaper Pressure piles on Biden over Trump era Kenya US trade deal. Mm -hmm. One of the biggest and most influential US business lobby groups in America and a top American lawmaker on trade have urged the Biden administration to fast track the Trump era trade talks with Kenya. Mm -hmm. Piling pressure on Washington to conclude the, the negotiations. They also want Washington to dialogue with Nairobi on the basis of original or initial proposed model of a free trade agreement with Kenya. Mhm. Mm Sasa unajua kuna ile biashara between Kenya na US. Mm -hmm. So there there's so much pressure that is coming to the to Biden you about the Trump era that they should close the deal between Kenya and US. Mhm. Mm yes. So my cartoon for today. Mm -hmm. I feel ni kama ya jana. Yes. Kubwa kiongea unasameho. Yaani hakuna evidence ya makosa yako. Ah. Like Matiang yeah. Yes. <laughs> Na unakumbuka venye he felt like he was terrorized. <laughs> so sasa hizi Matiang hajashtakiwa you can just watch my cartoon here. Mm -hmm. So here is the mkubwa talking. So yes. uh, hii ni fagia kufagia makosa ya. Makosa yangu imefagiwa yeah, yeah, yote. Okay. <laughs> makosa yangu yote imefagiliwa <laughs> bado tuko pale moja kwa moja into the business numbers of the day telecommunication tuko side za telecommunication mm -hmm. safaricom actively moved 3.5 million shares valued at 68.5 million changing hands at between 18.90 and 19 shillings and 85 cents this is represented 48.38% of the day's traded value mm -hmm. These guys are really, really making a lot of money. Kuna pesa. Sisema ya uchumi ni mbaya. People are making profits yeah, here in there. Money. Yes. Kuna pesa. Yes. Aya, I'm with my dear and true ya Dairy Nation. Mm -hmm. Aya, I guaranteed a colleague run but he defaulted. What next? Hiyo 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 atwezi achiana. Mimi kwanza director na ni oh. Hiyo ni tume. Lakini siwezi mwache hiyo 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 deni. How? Aha oh, you know the funniest thing mm -hmm. acha ni talk in perspective oh, okay i do work with circle sometimes mm -hmm. before guaranteeing him to roll are you are you ready to handle the outcomes in the page page so oh, in in i can go for free oh, i can't get page for rent you are here how is yaka kwa page eh so is yaka tafadhali <laughs> Before Adi will put you your direct direct away to pesa. Mm. I wish I wish I knew. I wish I knew. Ah, ah, lakini do this. Pay the tithe. Hatapata money atarudisha. Anyway, it's my nini. <laughs> ah, nami moja kwa moja ninakupeleka outside the country na tulisema sisi kama mamlaka breakfast we give you politics outside the country and inside the world. Mm -hmm. Tunakupeleka Malawi. Mm -hmm. Malawi declares state of disaster as floods from cyclone kill 200 mm -hmm. 
-hmm. people. Mm -hmm. Almost 200 people are now confirmed dead in Malawi after a tropical storm mm -hmm. Freddy ripped from southern Africa mm -hmm. for the second time in a month. Mm -hmm. Terrifying amounts of brown water have cascaded through a neighborhood, sweeping away homes. Mm -hmm. This is so, we need to pray for Malawi. Mm -hmm. As a country, as people, individual, just say a prayer on Malawi as a nation. These people have, if you if you have the standard newspaper, if you are going to buy a standard newspaper, mm -hmm. the story is in page 26 of the standard newspaper. Mimi bado ni kwa pale kwa rinini kwa parenting. Mzazi. So, kama kawaida, tunakonga na segment relationship. Hi, Pastor Kitoto, I'm a mother of four but separated last year, I met a man who struck a friendship that drew into a relationship. He's mm. mature, 16 years older than me. He divorced his wife, first mm. wife, but got a child with another woman. Pastor, I'm a big password mm. by this man. He has introduced me to a few friends and some family members, which makes me think he's serious. Yani hajambiwa mtu wako serious, but he, she thinks. Yeah, imeenda. <laughs> the man is serious. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> I feel neglected in this area. Could he be having, okay, a uh, in story in a relationship, someone had a kwambia and a kupenda, and you feel and a kupenda. If someone has not told you, no need of forcing. That's an advice to our viewers, Pala Nyumbani. You see, you see, false veto. It's not <laughs> I bad. I am a hero giving vulnerable children a reason to smile. Our hero wow. today. And I, uh, uh -huh. our hero today. And I tell our friends. We host children for a maximum of three years, helping them to recover for those who are sick and finally reunite them with their family. He's the hero of the day. Our hero of the day. Now, me in Mojo Komodo ni nakupeleka katika sports. Sports is zetu leo tunaangalia katika pe ukurasa wa the Latini na Nane. Mm -hmm. Page 38 of the standard newspaper. Frida Lodepa gunning for our seventh Lewa Safari race title. Our people... Our, our people in Eldoret are making us proud. Mm -hmm. Decorated Frida Chep Chepki Ledepa will head for a seventh title in the 24th edition of the Lewa Safari Marathon to mm -hmm. be held at the Lewa Conservancy in Isiolo County on June 24th. The mother of three embarked on intense training on January 10th at her base in Iten with her Cloud 9 Athletics Club in readiness to defend the women's 44 two kilometers category. She dominated last year in the annual race whose proceeds are channeled towards wildlife conservation. Now, director, I'm going to take a break. But mm -hmm. before you take a break, Unga in Mesemekana, it's a talk to 30. It's a talk to 30. Uh-huh. A packet of two kilograms. Mm. In Lift Valley, mm. when you kuna kuwa mahidi, mm -hmm. to 30. Yeah, well. Our viewers, Pale Nyumbani, those has been our re newspaper review. Asante ni sana for joining us for uh, this segment. When we take a short break, we'll be coming back with the Kingdom Investment. That is our topic of the day. Remember, you can speak to us through our Facebook, Mamlaka TV. Comment down there. Share this video. You can also go to Grace Njeri Facebook page. You can comment there. Warenga Wajomo Facebook page, you can also comment there. Mm -hmm. And our SMS line is 0700 899 or 0721 899 We are taking a short break. But before that, mm -hmm. holiday a Monday. That is our question of the day. Who has given us a public holiday? Tunachukua couple la maji na tukirudi. Mm -hmm. Tunarudi na watopi. Uh -huh. Now before that, mm -hmm. what about Toku Rikori? <laughs> Tunarudi <laughs> kuandia. Mm -hmm. Lazima you appreciate that person who catered for your makeup. Otherwise, hakutoi kwa screen. Ay, 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 ay. Atafadhali, I'm sorry sana, madam. Nakuru College, bado tuko pale. Tunasema shule ni moja in Nakuru County. That is Nakuru College School of Commerce and Hospitality. It's located along... Nakuru City, along Kenyatta Avenue, if I'm not wrong, mm -hmm. Equator House, fourth floor, next to a retro bookshop. They have, they offer these courses, School of Hospitality, it's still, it's wide, mm -hmm. conduct some stories are catering and bakery. Mm -hmm. School of Tourism, what wanapenda sana kukwenda ama tours. Mm -hmm. School of Business, what wanapenda ma biashara. Mm -hmm. School of ICT, mm -hmm. Computer Sciences, all those stuff. Mm -hmm. School of Accounts, thanks to them, I'm, a, I'm an accountant. Mm -hmm. School of Cosmetology. Mm -hmm. Cosmetology. 
cosmetology. Masikia. That is hairdressing and beauty. So thank you for my makeup. <laughs> School of fashion and design. She, they have designed this wonderful lady here, Anaka Vizuri. <laughs> School of Electrical and Engineering. Come on, talk some your stories are wearing. Mm. Steamers. <laughs> School of Languages. That is French, Spanish, German, sign language. Thanks to our interpreter, Ezekiel. He will be joining us at the lunch hour services. Make sure you umeangalia Mamlaka TV. You can contact Nakuru College School of Commerce and Hospitality through the numbers mm -hmm. 0727 42 Four six nine eight or zero seven two one five eight two five three two. Mm -hmm. Nakuru College School of Commerce and Hospitality, defining, defining culture, culture of professional endurance. Eh? Eh? Ni hao? Haja tupunge hewa chuo ya maji. Hmm. Shukwe kopo la maji na tunaporudi. Tunakuwa tukiangalia comments zenyu na tukiangalia more on the topic of the day. Joining us in our second segment. Na tunashukuru karibu ni tena. Thank you for being with us. Eh? Mm, tunaona saidi ya Facebook, tunaona saidi ya uh, SMS mm -hmm. via calls. Lakini calls si saizi. <laughs> <laughs> si saizi. Uh, Tukiangalia. Ni mbasa zingine. Mm -hmm. But before we go to the topic of the day, mm -hmm. kingdom investment, mm -hmm. si ukibia social media. Deo ni mekimbia social media, sa hizi, sa hizi. Uh, tuko pale side ya Facebook, Mamlaka TV. Uh, tunangalia Penina Nganga anasema ako tuned in. Fabian Kamau anasema anataka kitabu. Uh, hello guys, Prince Patrick ana ame comment pale. Joseph Moshangi anasema it is well loud and clear. Pangani we are tuned in. Mwena mm -hmm. waku tunasema <laughs> saidi yako kwa wenye hawelewi. Saidi yako saidi tunagani. Saidi yako wacha nitakupatia tukinini juu. Most I can see it's about kingdom, uh, kingdom mm -hmm. investment. Mm -hmm. And I feel I should do so after the topic of the day. Yes, before I turn to, to, to Rudy hapo vya tuliko tumesema our question of the day is who has given us a public holiday? Nana meamua Monday to singe kazi. Mm-hmm. Nanajua director anat, anat, anatuliza nani huyo. Uh, Adi wea najua director ujui, lakini Monday jitunge usitipata ya pasu buita ki hako. <laughs> Kuna possibility minister njehi hata kwa kwa camera peke yake. <laughs> lakini we thank God. Uh, if you are watching us at home, karibu sana to our third segments mm -hmm. whereby we'll be talking about our topic of the day if you're watching us at home my name is grace njeri and this is mamlaka breakfast yes and the topic of the day ni kingdom investment mm -hmm. ama investment in kingdom even yet to wiko na sana sana ukisikia kingdom investment kwa zile za si ni kuhubiri tu it's not just about kuhubiri Na uh, ni ku invest in the kingdom ni kuhubiri tu according to some mm -hmm. and it felt ni vizuri like we go in details about yes. the topic of mm -hmm. the day investing in the kingdom is doing what mm -hmm. na unafufanya nini mm -hmm. you know you can invest with what you have mm -hmm. what you do what you love meaning you can invest with Kama wewe, sasa wewe. Offering myself as a living sacrifice. Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. You know, no, no, it's the Holy Spirit speaking unto me. Mm -hmm. mm. And he's um, telling me, Grace, offer yourself as a living sacrifice. Mm -hmm. That's you know, also investing. Una, una shindu, in the kingdom, do we really need investors? We really need we, In we business, do. we need, yes. Mm -hmm. Being a business when is the... In business, we need in investors. Mm -hmm. Una wenda, una mpatia ki idea. Una mbia mia ataka kuko fashion designer. Mm -hmm. And you know, this is what I can do. It will require this capital. Mm -hmm. This is the money that we need to input. Mm -hmm. Even if you want to become a drama. Eh, drama panso, una wenda pali nambia. Hey! <laughs> nikona, nikona idea. Na hili idea li nataka ni kue hivi. <laughs> Alafu ni nakuja ni nasema hamjamboni. Mm -hmm. Yes. Invest in me, this will be the returns. The same in the kingdom. Mm. There is, you know, in the kingdom, the kingdom need money. Kindly, mm -hmm. tafadhali, don't call. <laughs> 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 Nanishtua. 
<laughs> the kingdom need money mm -hmm. for it to run. Na venye kuna wahubiri wameitwa na Mungu. There is also investors in the yes. kingdom. And I want us to look at uh, the verse of the day that we had today. Tutaeleka moja kwa moja to the verse of the day. Our verse of the day was coming from the book of if kama unakumbuka si unajua tu mimi nitakwambia Hebrews. Hebrews. Uh, so you just know me with the Hebrews. Wewe unataka kukuambia wewe sio unajua tu mimi na vi Hebrews sisi ni marafiki. Tafadhali tusomee, tusomee hiyo Hebrews and unataka kutusomea. Mzazi wa mzazi Jomo, tafadhali school fees iko hapa. In the school fees ya mtoto wako. Yaani Hebrews 6:10 I'm not wrong. Mhm. Mm ni 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 Hebrews 6:10 inaitwa je na Kiswahili? Ahibirania. Ahibirania. Reverend Benson Nanga, we need we need someone here to be taught what is Hebrews in Kiswa Hili. Hebrews 6:10. Hujafika bado? Sijafika. Hujafika bado? Ah ah. Ndio hiyo. Hebrews chapter 6 uh, verses 10. That is our verse of the day. Mm -hmm. And in Asema, God is not unfair. He will not forget the work you did or the love you showed him in the help you gave and are still giving to your fellow Christians. Mm -hmm. I repeat, I Hebrews chapter 6, verse 10 to 11. God is not unfair. He will not forget the work you did or the love you have showed him in the help you gave and are still giving to your fellow Christians mm -hmm. verse 11 our great desire is that each of you keep up the eagerness to the end so that the things you hope for will come true amen you know when you try when you are investing in the kingdom of god there is those hopes that you have mm -hmm. like unataka mlango fulani zifunguke unataka mungu akufanye jambo fulani you have it be necessarily like i just want something so i'll invest for it to happen You know as as most people their views and their thoughts is mm -hmm. that you know, it's a two way thing. Mm -hmm. I do this, God do this. Mm -hmm. If God is not doing this, I won't do this. <laughs> One thing I'm sure about, mm -hmm. our God is always so faithful. Yes. So whatever you do, do it ukijua kuna mazao. Do it to kijua it's not in vain. I love the story of Dorcas, you know. Yes, Una Dorcas mjua. and the purple clothes. Unamjua? Mm -hmm. <laughs> This woman alikuwa akifanya si aonwe like she was doing it from deep down her heart. Mm -hmm. Yes, so, true. Hadi wenye alikuwa na shona hizo sweater, she knew very well how watu hawezi refund anything. Hadi mm -hmm. uzi. Acha <laughs> uzi. Hadi shindano they can't refund anything. Mm -hmm. But she did it kutoka ndani ya moyo wow, wake. Okay. When the time she when the time came mm -hmm. and she died mm -hmm. and the people felt who you had to mm. You know there there comes that time people they are like who you mm to had to mazuri yake ni mazuri sana mm. forced to let her just go. Yes. Because she invested mm. her time her everything to the windows our watoto wenye wana wazazi and the investment were not in vain. Yes. To shikanisha na Mm. Najua unamtafuta. Namtafuta. Eh, Tushikanishe na Cornelius. 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 Si Corre. Cornelius. Cornelius. The the are is silent. The queen in me can't allow the are to be silent. Hiyo <laughs> <laughs> story ya uh, Dorcas unazoipata in the book of Acts chapter 9 mm -hmm. verse 36. Mhm. Mm Uh, in Joppa there was a woman named Tabitha mm -hmm. who was a believer mm -hmm. her name in Greek is Dorcas as we have said mm -hmm. which means a dear mm -hmm. so it was itwa Doru na Dorcas Doru na Doros ni dear when it was dear yani dear d e r yeah, D -E -R. Uh, she spent all her time doing good and helping the poor mm -hmm. at that time she became ill and died her body was washed and laid in the room upstairs Joppa was not very far away from Lydia and when the believers in Joppa heard that Peter was was in Lydia they sent two men to him with the message please hurry and come to us so Peter got ready and went with them when he arrived he was taken to the room upstairs when all the windows the widows crowded round him crying and showing him all the shirts and coats that Dorcas had made while she was alive mm -hmm. 
wow. wakaonyesha what she had, she had, di, uh, had done to their lives mm -hmm. the mark she had left in their life mm -hmm. and there is also this man aligonjeka in the synagogue men felt huyu mwanaume amegonjeka and we wouldn't let him to die it's mm -hmm. in new testament i can't mm -hmm. remember the priest or the chapter mm -hmm. na wakaenda kwa yesu mm. and they told christ Uyu mwanaume anafaa kuponywa juu number 1 alijenga ile sinagogi huko chini True. Uh, you know when mm -hmm. you read my bible i mm -hmm. always try to imagine huyo mtu in person when mm -hmm. sasa ana, anaambia Yesu amejenga hii sinagogi hapa amefanya hivi so this man deserves to live mm -hmm. and yes that man deserved to live Naka it's also achieve. said that whatever you plant it so what you shall you reap mm -hmm. You can always panda mbegu mbegu mbaya and mm -hmm. then you expect you will have something good. Mm -hmm. Whatever you sow, mm -hmm. so shall you reap. <laughs> and the other side, by the way, we're just to meleta ya the good things. Eh? <laughs> there is this man who was serving a raja. Tulimungelele ya jana. Mwenye watoto waka walikuja wana kuchotu wa juu ya dini. He had copad. Aliache watoto de. Dini. Dini. So, uh -uh. <laughs> so whatever you are doing. Mm -hmm. Angalia the coin in both sides. Either good or bad. And there is one thing I will say, and I always insist. Mm -hmm. Na kikuyu we do say, gaitimole ya ngoro. Mm. Yani mungu, si mwana adamu, ajifanya ya honi whatever you are doing. Yes. It's not a man to forget what you are doing. And also he never sleeps and he never slumbers. Mm -hmm. He's always awake. Mm -hmm. Whatever you saw, aro upande sasita, mm -hmm. wamuke 5 a.m. in mm -hmm. the morning. Mm -hmm. Whatever you have added in the kingdom of God, mm -hmm. he will re repay you back. Mm -hmm. Whatever you added shall be added unto you back. So there's a verse that says that. Yes. Mm -hmm. Uyo mtoto wa yatima mwenye unavisha. Uyo mtoto wa yatima mwenye unasomesha. Mm -hmm. Uyo mama mjane mwenye unahakikisha amekula. Mm -hmm. Those street family that you are feeding. My friend, it won't be in vain. Actually, they are on to that. There's a lady who does an amazing work mm -hmm. in the streets of Nakuru. And she feeds these children. Mm -hmm. Almost every Sunday. Almost like 300 kids, street families, mm -hmm. and our feed. Mm -hmm. You know, God and I'm one I kill a pallet, you are like, sure, you are doing a, something amazing in this in this city. Mm -hmm. You are doing something amazing into the kingdom. You know, Jesus said, Let the ch little children come unto me. Sure. And this person, Atakama Ukum Chafu Aji, Ukona Matamba Raji, she has embraced them. Mm -hmm. The same thing with Pastor Patricia, she mm -hmm. does mm -hmm. the Better You Foundation. Mm -hmm. She gives free medical camps to this to the people who living with disabilities, mm -hmm. and you know these are the guys when they have been left out in the society. Mm -hmm. But she's planting something in the kingdom of God, mm -hmm. and let me tell you, these meetings are amazing. Mm -hmm. You should come one day, one time. You are not lazima. Mm -hmm. You are not lazima. So to me, agree in whatever you are doing. Yes, being it good. Being it bad. Kama unafanya watu wa silale juu ya matendo yako, acha ni kupigia makofi, you gonna harvest. Mm. You gonna ha It's not just about whatever you do, mm -hmm. as in kwa church or anything. Mm -hmm. But it starts with where you are, with your family. Well, your working your place working, also. Your working environment, mm -hmm. who you are staying next to. Najua mm kuna watu wana ingianga kwa office and everybody is like, Mwona mingia. Unawana, unawana sasa kama ni hapa, tuseme kama ni jowana mingia, tuko zile za, hai, isi kutaisha. Like, hii kazi itaisha. You know? Yes. Be that person like everybody anataka kwa zushitu with. You are not the source of blood pressure, diabetes. Yeah. Kuna watu wakona diabetes kwa hizi offices za Kenya, juu ya manager au supervisor. Wah, ah. You don't know. Let me tell you, if you treat people who are around you badly, mm -hmm. you know whatever you saw, sparingly, mm -hmm. you shall reap it. So, so when you expect, mm -hmm. you treat your family bad or you treat your the people you are working with bad, mm -hmm. you expect that God is happy with you. Sure. You are still investing in the kingdom of God in a bad way. Mm -hmm. Now to harvest. And you'll harvest that. <laughs> anyway, see, we take a break. We'll take a short break. And when we come back, Tunaenda kumalizia kipindi chetu cha leo asubuhi. Our answer, our question bado kwa pale hivyo who gave us a public holiday. Mm -hmm. And we are by tuko happy we are really happy for that public holiday. Kwa sababu ninajua Monday siko kazi. Grace we cost to violence. I'm really happy. Let's take this short break and when we come back tunamalizia kipindi chetu.
Fathomable and Fathomable. Wow, that's an amazing song by Mary Morgan. Asante sana Mary Morgan for an amazing song. It's a blessing to us here at Mamlaka Breakfast. Asante sana mtazamaji wa Mamlaka TV for staying with us all the way from Asubui Mpaka Sahize. Waringa. He, tupatia knowledge. Kabla tumalizia. Tini miangu ni seme anpomata bu. Si mimi zinasikia venye anasema ama nikaangusha chini. Let let peace reign. Let peace reign. Acha tukaangushe. Si just unajua saa hizi hiyo ni kuisha inaisha tunajua tuko na 3 minutes. Tumalize hiyo mama. But before that si tufike tu kule na ku encourage. Tufike na ku college ama kwanza tuanze vitabu za Rev kwanza. Oh tuanze hizi. Mhm. Mhm. Anyway you have the books with us na I have three books with me. Yes. Na hizi kubwa. They're going for 500 Kenyan shillings. Mhm. Aya, ya kwanza The Night Celebrations. Hey, unazijua fed msichana. Aha, describe the book. The book kama ume dinaiwa kwa hii life, una feel like people are not fair to you. Like right now una feel like uko na pressure mingi. Watu wakufanyi birthdays. Mtu mtu ah ah kwa ni birthday imekuwa ikwe topic eh yeah, so it's been celebrated someone is not celebrating you your parents your your partner your husband your children mm -hmm. this is your book mm -hmm. like advice this is your book the night celebration mm -hmm. by reverend ben songanga kama unataka hii kitabu mm -hmm. tafadhali use the number that is on your screen to order mm -hmm. and we are going to deliver it to you pale mahali ulipo mhm mm na naona kuna kitabu kingine ameandika seen that causes premature death mhm mm a uh, first in spirit mhm mm dose of favor yes oil of a deliverer mhm mm but all from bad Battles from birth tangu lipozaliwa. Mhm. Mm Kuna battles from birth also going for 500. Yaani tu na feel mimi kutoka nizariwe. Maisha yangu imekuwa ikienda mbele inarudi nyuma. Mm -hmm. Ni I'm trying to make a step mbele lakini it's not working inarudi nyuma. Yaani naenda ile tunasemanga to the end of bere. Hanini alafu toshoke dhuza. Hanini you know you're going you coming you going you coming. Yaani uju maisha yako yeleweki vile iko. Unachanga umenunua ka Honda Beat I laughed the other day kwa on sale. Yes. Tunaacha umenunua taki then the other day you know when God elevates he elevates mm -hmm. and, and he give you grace. Yes. To stay there. Amen. Yes. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so <laughs> what is from bad? Yes. Yeah, you, you have just the like, grace to contain you. Eh? Aishi, keep this book. Eh, unaiona director wangu? Are you seeing it? Juu hapa sijui kama ni battles uko nazo. Awe. Ah, next book Maringa. <laughs> We have the oil over the river. You know, mm -hmm. okay, najua dakika zetu zimeisha, but being an oil uh, the oil over the river. Mhm. Mm this book ni ile ni ile mtu mwenye akokoa na na feel this is not how my family should be. Mm -hmm. Brothers wangu hawafai kukaa kwa drugs. Hatufai kukuwa na divorce in family. Yes. Hatufai kukuwa ati tunasomesha watoto they are not working. Mm -hmm. you, know, oh, you know, the Bible says, until when you get tired mm -hmm. and stand and fight for yourself. Mm -hmm. Niza kalikuwa nambia his son after kubariki mwenye haku abarikiwe. Mm -hmm. So, until you also notice some things, mm -hmm. you need to get this book to help you to fight those battles. Yes, uh, before sasa hata tumalize, mm -hmm. Acha director wangu tafadhali niongeze masaki dogo tuende na Kuru College. I have the book of the favorite. Ah, kabla ni tafadhali pole ni pole. My apologies to the director pole. Siku hizi uko anambia kwenda wapi? Na Kuru College, na Kuru College nataka niende nitaka kuingia class hizi. Ndio so favor. Mhm. Tuko nayo. Alafu nasikia breakfast imepikwa huko na machef. So kindly Hey. Hey. I send it to another ah, you, you, you have to check this grace. Uh -huh. Kind of See director. See you crop out to the next minute uyu acha 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 tunini. Sasa nami moja kwa moja ninakupeleka upande wa Nakuru College. Mm -hmm. Nasikia no, kiswali changu sikizi kime kimebunika. Moja kwa moja. Moja kwa moja. <laughs> one, one by one. One by one eh. 
Nakuru College School of Commerce and Hospitality. Mm -hmm. It's located in Nakuru City, the heart, the okay. only city eh, that it has a female female politicians. Kwanza mwanzo wa dichini. I'm say wa kwenu ni nani? Atasuji. Tunajua ni Nakuru Girls Director, we know lakini I have to confirm her MC. MC. MC 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 sinajua ni director. MC wa kwenu MCA. Asijui lakini director wangu atani 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 Nakuru College School of Commerce and Hospitality tunasema shule ni moja Nakuru County eh mm -hmm. kuna shule ingine utazunguka Nakuru upate upate ma, masomo ma, maarufu mm -hmm. Nakuru College School of Commerce and Hospitality wako na courses malimbali uh -huh. artisan courses certificate and diploma mm -hmm. this school is located in Nakuru mm -hmm. Equator House building in Ito Equator House mm -hmm. fourth floor next to a retro bookshop mm -hmm. we have school of hospitality mm -hmm. school of tourism mm -hmm. school of business studies mm -hmm. school of ict mm -hmm. school of accounts mm -hmm. school of cosmetology mm -hmm. school of fashion and design mm -hmm. school of electrical engineering mm -hmm. school of languages kwa wale watu wanapenda lugha yangu tunasoma pale lugha ya ujerumani lugha ya uspanishi na lugha ya ufrenchi and you must do use your lipstick isha kabisa. I love tuko na wale wanapenda sign language uh -huh. our Ezekiel interpreter uh -huh. wako pale and registration is ongoing so mm. kimbia pale na Kuru College ujipatie nafasi pale mm -hmm. namba yao ya simu ni 07 oh guy poleni sana 0727424698 ama 072158 Two five three two. Mm -hmm. Unaweza waandikia email kupitia info at nakurucollege.ac.ke. Mm -hmm. Narudia. Info at nakurucollege.ac.ke. Mm -hmm. Wako Facebook, mm -hmm. Instagram and Twitter. Na tunasema Nakuru College of Commerce and Hospitality. Defining, Defining culture. culture of professional excellence. Eh? And the exams, by the way, they are governed by NITA mm -hmm. and CASNEBA. Na bado kama uko pale sijui kama wako na neck lakini watatuambia. Mhm. Mm Najua sasa tuli sisi wenye tulizoea neck. Mhm. Mm Kuanzia tukiwa tukiwa darasa la nane. Mhm. Mm neck me to the terrorize. Mhm. Mhm. Mm Haya kama ungetaka ku advertise with Mamraka TV. Yes. You only advertise verified companies. Yes. Ultra. Mhm. Mm so get in touch with us. Yes, you can get in touch with us through 0700-899-899 or 0721-899-899. Naona deka zetu zimeisha. Yes. Meaning we won't have time ya kunini kureview the majibu. Yes. But the person who gave us the whole day on Monday kama kawaida tunamjua kwa inchi yetu ya Kenya, it's none other than his... Tramita is excellent yama Tramita. Kiongozi wa chama cha Azimio. Honorable Raila Amolo Odinga. Ukose kuenda kazi zemeti. Asanti sana kwa kutupatia holiday. <laughs> Tunasema ni asanti sana. Kwa sababu ume, umetuangale sisi kama maslahi yetu ya Monday. Tunakoga na shida ya kuamuka. Director wangu. Tufadhali minu wajua niko, niko off. Mandi. <laughs> Wewe, kosa kuenda kazi. Kuji, kosa kuenda kazi ya tuisemu kina warenga they said kuna off. <laughs> uh, no, baba alis, baba ndo ali, alisema. So, mm -hmm. it's not a proven holiday ama kitu, ki, kitu yenye imepitishwa. Na director pia amesema, wewe ukose kukuja kazi, uandike termination letter of the contract. Ok. Asandi sana. <laughs> Asandi sana mtamaza maji wa mamlaka TV and mamlaka breakfast. Asante sana kwa kututazama kutoka asubuhi hadi saa hii. We say thank you to our viewers pale nyumbani. Our time is up. It's time to end and to wrap up the show. Mm -hmm. Tukutane lunch hour services 12:30 p.m. Mm -hmm. all the way to 2. Tutakuwa na Reverend Benson Nganga, our bishop elect wa Nakuru City, a, B, a new bishop elect. Mm -hmm. no? mm -hmm. noted. Mm -hmm. Tutakuwa pale lunch hours Nakuru City Sanctuary Chosen Generation Church Nakuru. I have been your host Grace Jerry. Mhm. Mm Nenasikia kuna dinner. Dinner. Eh huh? yeye yeah, kwa, kwa chakula director hizi kosa lakini tuko na dinner on 31st of March pale vyo Rift Valley Sports Club of Nakuru City. Mhm. Mm tutakutana pale hivyo na mm -hmm. si tutakuwa na mgeni mashuhuri. Mhm. Mm 
ambaye anatoka Nigeria mm -hmm. Sijui kama una hiyo mafuta na pia tutakuwa na askofu mkuu Archbishop Harrison K Nganga atakuwa pale hivyo. Mhm. Mm we say goodbye. Asanteni sana mtazamaji wa Mamlaka TV. Mm -hmm. Our social handles bado ni zile zile. Tafadhali like, subscribe, share. Usikose kushare sana sana hapo hivyo. I've been your host Grace Njeri. Nene warengwa njomo tupatane kesho ikiwa ni throwback Thursday utuambie what you remember about throwbacks. your throwbacks. Eh, okay mtotoni zile activities. Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. Watoto wita bix. <laughs> anyway, tupatane kesho have a lovely day. <laughs> Okay. <laughs>